My name is Peter Kamure, as, as I've been introduced. In my presentation, I'll cover, four, I'll cover five things. One, we look at, the, at, uh, at some of the statistics uh, on, 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 on digital marketing. Then we look at uh, digital, market, uh, uh, digital and traditional marketing. What has changed, what, what was not there years ago, and what is uh, there right now, and what, has, what are some of the improvements that are, that are there. Then we look at uh, how to come up with a digital marketing plan. Uh, then, uh, then we look at uh, converged media. Then, lastly, we look at myths that uh, that are associated with the digital marketing uh, in 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 uh, uh, today. So, um, what 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 do you what do we understand by the term digital marketing? When you hear digital marketing, uh, what 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 comes into your mind? I know I, I know of late this this word has been thrown here and there. By, 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 by many people, including those who tell you to, 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 to make, to, I think to make three of, or five thousand a day in digital marketing, and, 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 and you'll think maybe it's, maybe it's a con. And, and, and in the, in the, uh, in, in the course of uh, the presentation, we'll see whether, whether they are truly, whether that truly can happen or, or, or it's just a, 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 a con. So, uh, someone can help me answer what 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 comes to your mind when you hear digital marketing it's the use of internet to sell products and services use of internet to sell products and services a nice trial uh, your, your name i never forgot your name Oh, Walter, Walter, thank you. Like how Jumia does, uh, 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 does, uh, does it. Jumia, uh, Jumia uses SEO, that, that is one. If you, if, you, if you sometimes Google kill him all on, 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 on Google, you'll find Jumia around number two, number three, or maybe sometimes even, even number one, treated their ad. So, and, uh, or maybe you're Googling something, something like maybe fonts in Kenya, or maybe Infinite uh, 530 in Kenya. You'll... Uh, uh, you likely find uh, an online shop like Jumia. They are uh, there on top. There, uh, then when you click on it, it will it will take you to their website. So that's SEO leading you to to uh, to their now here. It's uh, it's website, not a blog. Then, uh, then sometimes they use uh, uh, they use PPC. PPC stands for pay per click, where uh, where you'll see pop up ads almost almost on most on most websites. And then when you click on it, it it it, it will take you now to uh, now to this website. Then sometimes uh, sometimes they use content. Sometimes they use uh, they will send you promotional emails. Then uh, then they bring you here. Then uh, then when you come here now, I know they sell now the product. It's like they converge all of you. Uh, those who have clicked on the SEO, those who uh, 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 those who are, uh, those are from PPC, those who are. Uh, those who clicked on the email, then you are brought to the uh, to the uh, to the website. Then now you you uh, you are prompted now to buy uh, maybe their product or services or service. Another good example is sort of something like this event. This event was uh, was was on the was on the website. I think it was 2018.wordcampmombasa. Yeah, I think dot com. I guess. Yeah. So 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 what used to happen is. Uh, someone will send you a link, maybe probably through WhatsApp or maybe through Facebook, or maybe you'll have uh, a, a, a Facebook uh, event that is, uh, that is now Word, uh, WordCamp Mobasa. Then, uh, th then when you click on it, it will take you to, to now the website where now you can buy the ticket. So, uh, so uh, this was, 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 was also some, some sort of digital marketing where, uh, where you use different a different uh, media platforms to uh, to bring people uh, to sell your product or your service. How you get the emails is, for example, if you are buying something maybe on on Jumia, most probably you leave them with your uh, with, with your mobile number and uh, and probably your email. So next time they'll use the same email to send you promotional uh, products, um, uh, promotional emails for other products that maybe will be there in future. So for the, uh, so for them having that. Having your email in their email list is sort of like an asset, or maybe or maybe an added advantage to them, such that they can use the same to send you promotional emails, or maybe for numbers to send you maybe text on on, on maybe future uh, future promotions. Then I will look at some 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 facts about uh, about digital marketing. 
uh, or about the use of technology, um, then four billion people in the world use internet. Uh, I think the, the, the currently the population, I think the last population, it, it, it should be around uh, eight, nine billion. So having, having half of those people using, uh, using internet, uh, it, it tells you that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, that if you put your, uh, your product or, uh, or service online, you will have at least a, very, uh, at least a percentage that will, see, uh, that will see it and probably uh, maybe, uh, maybe convert and, 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 buy, and buy it. How you scroll uh, on, on your laptop or your, or your phone in a near, it will equate to 118.2 five kilometers i think it's it's even more than more than you would walk in a knee actually so uh, so that will tell you that uh, that there are very many people who 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 uh, uh, who access the internet especially especially uh, especially facebook twitter and all uh, and all these other uh, uh, social media platforms that are uh, that uh, that are available so uh, uh, so realizing this it it actually calls for you to if you're creating content, create content that, that when a person is scrolling, uh, no matter how fast they are scrolling, they will at least see your, your, your content and probably uh, buy into it. Then next, the last one is, uh, is 75% of Kenyans bought something because they saw it on social media. I think this was the last year. And, and, and this just shows you the, uh, the power of social media. If 75% of people bought something because they saw it, so it tells you that uh, uh, that if you if if you post something on, on social media, even if a person would buy it right away, at least at least it creates uh, with time they remember that brand. It's, it, it creates familiarity into them such that in future uh, they'll probably buy it or maybe buy it immediately. So uh, so uh, a product not converting right away does not mean that it won't convert later on. So. Uh, so one, of course, should not be discouraged while doing that. Uh, then, next we look at the digital versus traditional marketing. Uh, who will give us some, uh, some examples of, uh, when, when we look at digital marketing, who will give us some examples of traditional marketing that was there before, before, before the internet and, and technology came? Who will give us some examples of, digital, of traditional marketing? You could advertise in magazines, on yeah. TV, in yeah, newspapers. Magazines. Then Ma there was wall branding. Yeah, wall branding. So just imagine how, uh, uh, how much effort you will put on traditional marketing to reach, let's say, 5,000 people uh, on, on maybe a campaign or maybe a, a service that you're offering. Uh, you are reaching, you want to reach 2,000 people, or rather, yeah, yeah, five or, or, or 2,000 people. On, on tradition, you will have to use broadcast, you will have to use newspapers, you have to, have to use magazine, you will have to use direct mail. Because, for example, like, like if you're using brochures, you will have to print 2,000 brochures for each person to see, assuming that you're giving each person one brochure. If, if it's newspapers, you will have to, you, you'll have to find 2,000 people to give them each a newspaper, to read so that they can see your ad, assuming that they're not sharing. And so, and so looking at the cost, how much you'll incur on traditional, on traditional uh, marketing, it becomes very expensive. But imagine if you have, have 5,000 or rather 2,000 uh, followers or people who have liked your page or maybe your group uh, on, on Facebook or, uh, or Instagram, just posting that are posting a, 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 an ad there, they will see without you, uh, without you even, uh, 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 without you incurring anything. And so that's, uh, that's the power of digital marketing. Just posting, uh, or maybe let's say you have like 10,000 people who follow you, or maybe who, who see your post. If you, if you post it, you, you'll find maybe like two or 3,000 people. Uh, viewing it without without even you incurring anything because uh, because of course you never paid to to to, to have the the uh, the platform the social media platform and so this just uh, this, this just shows the power of digital of digital marketing versus uh, versus the traditional marketing and so it's it's upon us to uh, to use 
digital ma a, a digital platforms effectively so that they can serve the purpose that we uh, that we, uh, that we want uh, next we we'll look at know that know that you've seen about digital marketing uh, digital marketing and and maybe probably we are somehow convinced that that maybe it's the way to go so where would you start if if maybe you are to if maybe you have uh, something like a, like a new product that you that uh, that you have that you have or maybe a, a new service or maybe a new business that you're starting and you want to to go to go to to make it visible online where would you start where uh, how 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 would you make your uh, people who are online what well, they call the online community how would you make them to to view uh, to view your product or your service so uh, that will lead us to uh, to a, to dig, to a digital marketing plan and a digital marketing plan is 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 very vital in any digital marketing strat in coming up with any any digital marketing strategy because it helps you to not go to the uh, online blindly because uh, because sometimes people think that just posting posting just something on uh, on facebook today maybe maybe tomorrow you are busy the following day you post maybe after a week you you, you forgot would make your product sell uh, I, I may be too old but not as effective as if you if you have sat down and come up with a digital marketing plan or other digital marketing strategy so I want us to go through this well uh, a bit quickly so uh, or rather maybe uh, maybe it's not you maybe you have been called to a company uh, and they and they and they, and they tell you to, to 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 handle to handle their digital uh, the uh, their digital marketing or maybe to uh, to be in charge of the digital marketing uh, department what will you do and actually last week i had i was telling a friend here last week i had the opportunity of 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 uh, of, of being called by by by, by a certain company that uh, that does tours and travel and they told uh, well they asked me if, if i could handle handle the uh, the digital marketing and it was it was it was very timely because it's when i was preparing actually this presentation and so and so i'm presenting this it's actually part of what i've been i've been doing for the last for the last one or two weeks uh, and so first first what you'll do you'll do a situation analysis especially uh, especially when you're starting a situation analysis it helps you to 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 sort of lay the background of everything that you'll be doing online e.g. what's what's the mission what, uh, what's the mission and vision of your company what 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 are you in the market to do is it is it is it to offer quality services is it to make your brand known is it to is it uh, is it is it to offer quality health care uh, such that you would know uh, when you're doing all this digital marketing uh, when you're posting stuff online you'll uh, you'll have at least a, 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 an objective that at least that at least uh, works uh, and that is in line with the whole with the whole uh, other uh, with other processes of a company because uh, because what we forget is that as much as you're doing digital marketing the company also does other marketing the, uh, the company uh, the company also uh, also does the the, the, the normal sales uh, sales, uh, sales marketing uh, the normal going to to customers and and, and convincing them uh, to buy uh, to buy your brand and so digital marketing should always be in line with 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 the normal kind of marketing such that uh, such that what you're presenting online your, your vision and mission online should always be the same with what with what the other people who are who are who, who are going to offices or maybe to homes uh, selling the service they, uh, that you at least at par then then after that you uh, you'll do a sort an, uh, a sort analysis what are your strengths as a company what are your weaknesses what are your what are the opportunities that are there and of course what are the threats that that that, that would uh, uh, that 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 would make your your digital marketing hard maybe for example uh, one of the threats will be maybe uh, you have uh, a, 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 another competitor like the company that uh, uh, that 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 called me it was uh, it, it was a tours and travel and on one of our threats it's uh, it's a company called uh, bountiful safaris and bonfire adventures because because such companies they are they are, they are very they 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 are if you look at their uh, the social media pages they are very active 
they they uh, they use a lot of resources to 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 boost their post to to uh, they use a lot of paid ads and so and so for us the challenge uh, uh, the challenge is now to 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 know how to how to how to place ourselves such that we'll, we'll, we'll probably overcome overcome that challenge or, or, or that uh, that threat then what is what is the current online presence as, especially for for a product that has been there what 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 currently are uh, where currently are they such that such that if you are going into it what can you improve then uh, and then lastly you should always define your target market who are you reaching such that uh, the target market actually will help you to know will, uh, is uh, is our target market on Instagram is our is our target market on Twitter is our target market on 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 uh, on, on Facebook where are they actually uh, such that you will you you won't be posting all all this stuff on this on this platform maybe there 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 are no there are no uh, there are no potential customers uh, there and and the prob uh, and the uh, the problem with, with 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 not having a target market, uh, or rather a uh, market to the wrong target market, is you end up uh, you, en uh, you end up setting yourself up for disappointment. You will, uh, you'll end up getting disappointed. Maybe you post something and and maybe it's it's like two or three weeks and there's no any like. There are maybe like five views, maybe uh, and maybe no comment. Another day, uh, other day you you probably think that that that, that this thing does not work. Then of course. It, it should be measurable, as, as I've said. Of course, if it, if it's likes, if it's followers, if it's tweets, if it's engagements, uh, you should be able to measure it. And the and the beauty of it is that these days uh, on Facebook you can find a lot of analytics. They uh, they actually break down for you. Even Twitter, it it do, uh, it does a lot of uh, breaking down of, of of numbers. You can you can actually generate your your analytics uh, either on daily or weekly or fortnightly or even monthly or, or yearly so so uh, so having measurable uh, measurable goals is is is, is something that uh, that should be in your digital marketing plan of course assignable something that uh, something that you can that you can uh, that you can assign to a person something that uh, something that you can actually attain something that uh, that, that won't be you uh, you just state state a number to please to please people in the office that oh by uh, by the end of the month you should have maybe like 500 followers and and you end up for, uh, failing to 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 reach there so they should be attainable and of course realistic and time bound you should you should have a time frame maybe maybe after a, after one week after three days after five week, five days or five weeks you should have achieved this and this and this and this and this and this. Then media selection, you should uh, uh, now this uh, this media uh, media selection uh, goes hand in hand, of course, with, with the target market. Who is your target market? Then, and then of course, you'll be, you'll be able to find them uh, there. Uh, so, so you'll know uh, what you're supposed to use. And even not uh, not only social media, you can. Uh, it can go past social media. You can even you can even do emails. Email marketing is part of digital marketing, part of the broad digital marketing. You can you can of course have a mailing list, and 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 probably maybe maybe segment it, maybe maybe on gender. If maybe if maybe your products are, if if for example maybe you 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 you, you your company does for example maybe like a what are they called? Uh, maybe like beauty products or maybe hair products. Uh, of course, you can't. Uh, you would market to 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 male, to male people. Well, you can, but uh, but mostly, of course, you should focus on female. Then, uh, your main actions. Your main actions here is is what what will be what will you be doing on daily basis? This uh, main main actions in, includes coming up with with something called a a, a, a posting schedule. Like for example. Uh, me, uh, what I've learned to uh, to do well personally is uh, probably on Sundays I come up with uh, with a schedule for the uh, for the week. That on Monday be posting this and this and this on this on this platform. On Tuesday it will be about this and this and this and this. On Wednesday it may be a, uh, 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 it may be a quote. On Friday maybe it will be a video on this po uh, uh, on this platform. Uh, uh, maybe on Friday it will be an uh, uh, it will be an article on LinkedIn. So. Having the main action, having having a schedule such that you know on Monday I'm expected to do this, such that by evening you'll you'll know I've done this, I've, I've, I've accomplished this, I've not accomplished this and this and this and this and this. 
then of course plan the strategies and actions. This of course uh, uh, linked with, 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 with the main action. Plan, uh, plan strategy, then, then finally do the actions and control. This, uh, uh, this probably now, uh, no, monitoring after, after uh, if you do it maybe weekly or fortnightly, you, uh, you will sit down and, uh, and see what we planned, uh, our goals, have, have we been able to achieve them? What have we achieved? What, what has been hard? Where, what, what, what can we correct? Then, uh, then of course, if, if it does not work, of course you come back to, know, to, uh, to the strategy. If it works, of course you'll, you'll see uh, if uh, it was worked, what, what can we borrow? What can we improve next time? Then, and then of course, it moves. And at the end of the day, if, if, if you do this, this so well, of course, of course it will have, it will have a, a, an effect in, 